Kaluokan, Malabon, and Navotas are adjacent local government units. These LGUs occupy a land area of 83.86 square kilometers, more than half the size of Quezon City. More than 1.7 million residents are adversely affected by perennial flooding during high tide. A vital flood control project strides along these LGUs to mitigate the damage caused by flood waters. This is the Kamanava Flood Control Project. Begun in June 2003, this 5.184 billion peso project virtually sets up barriers to protect the areas from flooding during high tide or continuous heavy rains. The project is expected to reduce by at least 75% the areas prone to flooding in Metro Manila. Unhampered mobility of the residents is one of the more important considerations. It is expected that living conditions and economic activities will improve significantly in Caloocan City, Malabon, and Navotas as the damage caused by floods are mitigated. Once completed, the MMDA's Flood Control and Sewerage Management Office is mandated to operate and maintain a project of this magnitude as provided for in Section 3D of Republic Act 7924. The Metropolitan Flood Control and Sewerage Management Office works hand-in-hand -hand with the Department of Public Works and Highways, the agency tasked to construct the project. The Kamenava project has two major components along the Malabon River. The northern section and the southern section. In the northern section, an 8.6 kilometer earth dike or polar dike is being constructed. The river wall shall be raised along a 3.46 km stretch. Navigation and floodgates shall also be constructed together with a pumping station. The southern section component of the project involves the raising of the river wall along a 3.3 km stretch on the left bank of Malabon River and another 4 km stretch along the Nabotas and Marala rivers. Four pumping stations are being constructed. While a 12.5 hectare regulation pond has also been allotted. Side by side the Kamanava Flood Control Project, the MMDA's Flood Control and Sewage Management Office continues to attend to its duties and responsibilities. Improvement or replacement of inadequately sized drainage laterals Maintenance of riverbank walls Continuous desilting Widening of waterways And installation of boom traps and garbage conveyors along rivers and esteros Every effort is being undertaken to enable Metro Manila residents and business establishments to attend to productive economic and social pursuits Flood control and surge management is a major component of that undertaking. MMDA, working for a Guapong Metro.